Hello, hello, hello everyone. I'm just here uh, doing an impromptu in the garden with Joyful Living. I haven't done any in quite some time because, well, it's been winter time and I don't normally do them in the winter. On occasion, uh, depends on the year and what I've got going on. So this winter, I didn't do any in the garden with Joyful Living. So, but this spring like weather is doing something to me. Spring isn't until March 20th and I have spring fever already. So I'm outside today looking around my gardening space, cleaning up things so that when March 20th gets here, I'm ready. Now, depending on the weather, I may not specifically plant on that day, but I know after spring gets here, then I'm watching the weather very closely so that I can put my um, plants outside, put my seeds in the ground, whatever I'm doing. So, I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm ready. I'm ready for this gardening season. And uh, I'm pre preparing for this gardening season. So, we've all heard the expression, um, stay ready so that you don't have to get ready. Well, this is me staying ready when I get my gardening space, get my my deck and my pots and all of my cleaning up all of my gardening gear, making sure my um, tools are clean because you know things can get bacteria and viruses on it. Just like bacteria and viruses can affect our body, it also can affect the plant. So, I'm cleaning up my tools, getting my space together so that. Uh, everything is ready for for springtime so that I can get my gardening season popping. I am ready this year. I don't even know what I'm planting this year, but that is part of my preparation process. I'll be sitting down this evening map, mapping out what I want to grow. Um, I do know that I'm going to have the same peppers that I had last year as well as my Japanese eggplant because they were so delicious and so such good producers I overwintered them indoors so let me tell you I don't know if I'll do that again because even though I tre treated the plant multiple times outdoors I put peroxide and water in the soil when I took them indoors I all all winter long luckily it was just in my office but i've been dealing with uh every few weeks uh uh insects hatching and things nothing major but i don't know if i'll do that again simply because of the insects i i'm lying i'm lying i'll do it again those plants did so well um I'll just try something different to make sure, sure it works. So I'm just doing this impromptu in the garden with Joyful Living today because I'm excited. That's it. That's the only reason. It's almost gardening season and I'm ready to get back outside. This is my happy time, my uh, springtime and summertime and even fall. It's my, sea, it's my seasons because I love being outdoors. And this weather, the 60s and 7 degrees, has me uh, spring fever and spring is what? Six weeks away, a few weeks away? I don't know. I know it's March 20th, so it's not quite here yet. But look for me to start doing more in the Garden Joy for Livings more frequently. And again, we'll get back on a regular schedule so that we can get this gardening season uh, popping. So that's all I wanted. I didn't want anything. I just wanted to share a little bit of my day with you that I'm out here enjoying it. And I'm happy to see that uh, the collard greens and the kale survived the bitter cold that streak that we had in December. Although pretty, uh, they may produce in the fall, but it just depends on what the weather is like. Whether they say, okay, we've been around long enough and they go straight to seed. I don't know what they're going to do. But I've still got green onions out here. I've got chives out here. Even my snow peas. Uh, the winter killed a couple of, what a, of them but a few of them are still surviving so i've got spring lettuce already popping up uh, my asparagus is already trying to to grow so the plants are telling me that they're ready so i'm ready too 
But anyway, guys, thank you for watching this impromptu episode of In the Garden with Joyful Living. I am Kimberly Dixon, and I will see you guys soon. All right, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.